What's up guys, Sammy D here, and welcome to a game that's still in early alpha, uh, and it's not Minecraft, but I really enjoy playing it. It's called Factorio, and it's a game built around automation, which is something I love to do in Minecraft, and I've been playing around with this, and it's just very fun to play. So, let's get started. We're going to do make a new game, and uh, we're going to leave this stuff alone. Uh, enemy base is normal. Everything's gonna be n normal, regular, whatever. Um, <clears throat> so, um, we're gonna just hit generate. Of course, like just about any game, there is we're gonna ignore that enemy base is around. Um, looks like I don't see any yet, but as you can see, spawn next to a big vein of copper and coal. Um, so the first thing we wanna do. So I want to automate production of coal. Now it's currently at this moment not really that much. Um, all we're, we're pretty much what we're doing is we're making a uh, we're, um, well first of all yes we need to make a pickaxe or an axe. Um, but what this is is a burner mining drill is pretty much a coal powered drill. That's slow. Um, so, we're going to set up, make a wooden chest, and what this pretty much does is it mines whatever is placed on, we're going to put some, um, stuff in there. It's really, really slow. We're just mining coal. Um, I'll be right back. I, you know, I might just create a new game and you never see this recording because I gotta check the uh, mining speed. Okay, I played around with the options. It's much faster now. I just had to set uh, it to low frame rate, um, and it seems to be better. So now we got a bunch of coal. We're gonna put this in the burner mining drill, and it's gonna start using the coal and it's mining, and it's creating coal for us. So in the first episode, first like less than five minutes. We've automated production of coal. Um, so now we want to look around. I want to find some uh, iron. Um, yeah, it looks like I'm much faster now than now. Um, okay, here's some iron. So we're gonna get up. We're just gonna start mining iron. Um, and now you can see it's starting to get nighttime. So lights, the lights came on. I can't tell, it looks like it's pink in the corner there, um, actually, let me turn down the volume, um, sound, there, I was, I don't normally record this, so I don't, didn't know, I've just been playing with that volume, now, what I was saying is, I think that pink in the corner, if it's pink, it's good, because that's, uh, oil. If it's red, that means it's, uh, enemies. Um, so now we got some iron. Is that some more iron up there? Uh, stone. Oh, actually, we'll need that later. So we're gonna go, we're gonna operate by our coal right now, and we're just gonna put down this, um, um, uh, that. Grab the coal. Put it in there start cooking up the iron um so I think what will I want to get done today is I want to get some power um Mo that's not usually something I'm usually able to achieve so early in like Minecraft but this is actually very easy to do um so we're gonna want um we're gonna want to start we're gonna growing to need or actually, let's just get. I think this first episode is just automating the basic resources. Um. So. Let us begin then with making another. Uh. Burner mining drill. We're gonna. Yeah, we're gonna need another burning. Burner mining drill to automate iron. And then copper. Um. So we'll come over here. Mine some more 
iron. Alright, I move my mouse. As you can see, it tells us how much we have. Um, so, we do eventually, like that orange thing said, that um, in the beginning of the episode, it said we needed to automate, um, we need to eventually get like missile launchers and stuff. Because what we're doing is we're getting this planet ready for colonization. And to do that, we need to defend against the natives. Um, and the natives pretty much are, I think they're called biters, and they will bite us, pretty much. Um, they will, they tear down machines, um, they're really dangerous, and to avoid them, what we need to do is, uh, pretty much kill them. Um, eventually we'll have the equipment to destroy their bases. But right now we just need to defend against them. Um, and we'll need like Gatling turrets. Um, we'll, like right now we have a pistol to defend ourselves against them, but it's not that much. Um, okay, let's grab some stone. I think I saw that over some a bit of it over here. Yep. And we need stone for some furnaces, and we're gonna need a few of those. Um. Because uh, we're going to be automating the production of iron plates instead of just the production of iron ore. Let's grab that. Um, oh, since that's done, we'll just pick that up for now. And okay, we are sh already have a pretty good amount of copper. Um, so let's make a burner mining drill. And uh, that's an electric one, but we're not there yet. Um, we're going to need uh, this. We're going to need two of those and one wooden chest. That'll be good for now. And we're going to come over to the iron over here. And we're going to uh, hit R to rotate that. We're going to put it there that there um where's the furnace uh, I thought we had another one uh, I guess when I broke it I lost it uh, I'll just grab some more stone but I'm pretty sure I don't have it um um Okay, stone furnace, and we'll put that down right in front of the inserter. Now what the inserter does, it picks something up and puts it in another. So then we'll put, and we can also take out of inventories. There. So now we need some coal for fuel. Um, how is this doing in fuel? Uh, okay, so we'll grab all that, we'll put some more in there, and we we'll come back over here, and I'm just going to split this into four. So now, put down iron, put it in there, and it will take it out. So we've automated the production of iron plates. Now it's quite slow because it's all coal powered and it's not fast at all. Um, so now let's us automate the production of, or let's make it so we can move this coal to wherever to every wherever we need it. Um, to do so, we're going to need transport belts, which are pretty much conveyor, conveyor belts. Um, which are like the pipes of build craft or the ME cables of applied energistics. Uh, we're going to craft a lot of these. Now, each one creates two, and you can see the stuff crafting, so it's not instant. Um, and we're going to pick this up. Uh, and put this down. 
you can see the stuff is moving along it. Um, now for the time being I'm just going to put it there because I'm not sure where I'm going to put the uh, copper mine yet. Um, so we're just start mining up some more copper. I think we need five copper per miner. Uh, so grab, well, I think we'll pick up 10 for the timing, um, just so we can, uh, can go, we have enough for other stuff. Um, we need another iron pickaxe. As you can see right now, the iron pickaxe isn't a good pickaxe, it's, uh, it doesn't have a good durability, um, need more iron, um, I'll pick up some more in a minute, and, there we go, now, in case, for instance, we were to run out of our, our pickaxe, we can still mine it, it's just going to be very slow, um, so, yeah, it's important that we have it. Um, I think we'll put it. I'll put it right here. Um, oh damn! I made an electric one. Oops. <laughs> well, we'll use that later. I'll, I'll, I guarantee it. Um, but yeah, we need. Th and that's where our furnace went. The burner mine drill requires a furnace. Um, that's why it said it requires ro one, five raw stone, because that's how much you need for a stone furnace. Um, and you need nine iron plates. Um, there we go. And we'll put that, uh, put that right there. So, I'm going to continue bringing this over, Ooh. and as you can see, we can ride on these. Um, we're going to need more, um, but we're going to grab some more iron, and we're going to craft up two of these. Us, I'm going to grab some more wood. I think wood might be the one thing right now that you can't automate, um, unfortunately, but this game, it updates about every two months, and <clears throat> I think uh, when it updates, they might add that. I'm not sure, but um, it's quite possible. So, see the entrance exit of that is there. So, we're going to put that there. One, two, three. Stone furnace. And then, we're going to make two more of these. We're going to grab some more iron. Craft up some more conveyors. And we need to move this out one more. Oops. So now I'm going to turn these, face them there grab some coal in each of these and they were going to start loading those with uh, things with coal. You see it's putting coal in them. It's only putting a certain amount in at, um, like I think five at a time. But as you can see now it's we've automated copper <clears throat> and coal is automatically going in there. Now another thing I want to do is I'm going to need some more iron is 
you can see we we still gotta do that automate that one but there's another thing we should automate we should uh, make sure there's we always have coal in this um we're gonna pick up some of these um so that like that and Gonna make a quick detour. Um, just gonna stand the edge of this. And if I hit F, I pick up stuff. So I pick up items on the ground. So I'm just going to put that. And when this this should I'm correct now. Um, There we go. So now, whenever coal passes it, it will fill it up. So make sure it always has five coal. And then when it goes past five coal, or, or when it get, hits five coal, it will start letting coal through. So you can see, automated coal now really well. And we're gonna grab some more iron plates because that stopped. And two more of those, and a bunch more uh, conveyor belts. And run this. Um, all the way over here. And well, I'm gonna grab some more coal so I can fill that up because we need more iron plates um so put that there and we're actually going to pick this up and put this bottom slots so in turn we can also put that there so <clears throat> more on plates can't grab that many at the moment um so I'm gonna dig Stop recording for a minute here to let um, the iron plate amount build up, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys. So I just finished it real quick. Didn't need that many, that many more iron plates, but I think we've finished for today. We've done pretty much all the basic automation. We've automated copper plates. Um, we've automated iron plates. We've automated coal. Actually, though, we have one more thing we need to automate. And that is stone. But I think I might do that off camera because you know what it's how it's gonna work. Um, and it's just pretty much the same thing. It's nothing really new. Um, <clears throat> but so you know what I'm going to save automating this so I get electric tools so I don't have to make any more of these coal power things because I don't want to use any more coal powered tools so yeah um I think that's gonna be it for this episode um if you have any, if you like the video if you want to see more please leave a rating that would be greatly appreciated if you have any questions comments concerns put them in the comment section below um, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. It would be greatly appreciated. And until next time, I'll see you guys then. Goodbye. <laughs>